that was such a lovely, lovely stay in San Anton last night. Oh, such a special place to be in. You know, this morning we all had some coffee and toast and we didn't start eating until seven. And I think everyone was just taking it really slow. There were no alarms. I mean, I think we just woke up when the hospitalero came and started making breakfast. We could hear her on the other side of the wall. And so it was just this really peaceful start to the day. But then all the pilgrims who had stayed in Hantanis started showing up um, at San Anton in the ruins to look around, which was totally fine. But I think for me, that kind of changed the mood. So I thought, okay, it's time to go. So I am now headed on the road. This is what the path looks like this morning. Really beautiful. The sun rising behind me. Oh, I feel like I can walk for a while. And we'll see. From Mista, I think is about 28 kilometers away, but I think there is a village a little bit before there that I might stop at. From Mista feels like could be a little too big and bustling of a place, especially after last night. So we'll see how I feel today, but good start to the morning. I'm walking along and feeling kind of hungry and I don't have like any snacks or food with me and a lot of that's just been timing. I've been staying in these small places without a shop and then when I pass through a slightly larger place it's too early in the morning. In Burgos when I passed through because of the festivals everything was closed. So anyway I haven't had any food to be carrying with me and that's not a huge problem because I just stop when I find an open bar but this morning I've been walking and I can just feel I'm hungry. And up ahead, I see this little grove of trees. Let's see if I can manage to zoom in. And there's like a little white truck. And I'm just kind of dreaming about that being like a pilgrim food truck. <laughs> so we'll see, hey, there's a chance. You never know, but we'll see when we get there. my Camino legs under me because I just breezed through those eight kilometers. I was listening to music and sometimes it gives me a little pep in my step, but it's one o'clock. I feel like I could keep walking forever, but I think I'm going to stop in this town. I'm in Bodia del Camino and just kind of with how the Masetta goes and the breakdown of stages, I think this will be a nice spot to stop in today. I'm trying not to rush. 
through the Camino. I have so much time. It's like good practice for me when I feel like I can walk like 30, 35 kilometers to just, you know, walk 23, 24 and just stop and enjoy the afternoon. So that is what I think I'm gonna do today. Yeah. <laughs> 